university did you attend? Obaseki asked Ushumale. There is no let up in the protracted rifts between Edo State Governor Godwin Obaseki and his predecessor and national chairman of the All Progressive Congress, APC, Adam Sushomole, with the wearing dua imputed academic sin to each other. Ahead of the party governorship primary in Edo's schedule for June 22, 2020, Obaseki and Oshomoles flew as exacerbated as the latter is avowedly opposed by the governor's re-election bid. The bitter exchange that characterized their fight has taken a new form with both accusing each other of parading theology academic qualifications. Oshomole dragged his predecessor to court seeking he should be qualified and disqualified from contesting the September 19 governorship election in the state on the ground that the university education certificate he paraded is forged. In the suit filed by one Edobo Williams, Egezie Godwin and Emedu Anakwa, it was alleged that the University of Ibadan certificate which the governor attached to its form CF.001 and submitted to INEC for its first term election in 2016 was forged. Oshomole has also set up three committees from the rancorous primary primary with one of the mandates to run the rule over aspirant academic certificate with with believe rifts that Obaseki is the target for establishing the committees. The screening is not a formal formulary and we expected that you to be very meticulous in every material in particular to protect our party so that it would not be said that we did not learn anything from Bayesa. As you know, sometimes when things go wrong, everybody sees it that NWC did not do a, a thorough job. So people personalized it. They say, if the chairman is, is thorough, if he has done his job, this will not happen, but that is the price for leadership. The ex governor said during members during members inauguration. However, the governor has pushed back at the claim of possessing forged certificates, just as he called out the former labor leader to say the university is he, he graduated from is fake. He have said before these allegations are baseless and come to think of it which university did adam Sushomole attend to know that the admission process is like the responsibility of setting guidelines for admission into a university rests on the senate of the institution the lecturers who taught the governors are still alive and the institution is still there is media aid Crucial Usagi to punchng.com. Thank you, viewers, for listening to this news. My question for both of the, for, for, for Adam Sushomole and Obaseki is when would this rift come to an end? When would this stop all this childish, childish behavior? When will they stop fighting with each other? When will they stop tackling each other for no reason? Because with this rift, I said it before, that this rift will cause so many problems, so many, mis so many things in Edo State, 
even the election will election a those state election will be will, will definitely be tampered with look at the way things are going if this rift is not there i'm very much sure that this question obaseki is asking Oshomole, wouldn't have been asked and this misunderstanding or this or um, tackling obaseki's result wouldn't have been wouldn't have been been in existence forging results i get the certificate and all of that wouldn't have been brought out this issue of for certificate won't have been disclosed because nobody or both of them are not having any rifts between each other but there is this this rifts that they are having and they have refused to settle this rift among each other and nobody has settled this for them i'm very much sure that this rift will cause so many so many things will even cause obaseki for not even winning for this election this rift they have would definitely cause or cause so many things might even put a stop to the election to the governorship election i see no reason why this rift between them should be causing or should be stopping Oshomole, or should be stopping obaseki from being the governor of the state or should stop obaseki from coming out the second time as the governor as the governor of Edo State. I said it before that this rift would definitely cause so many problems when the election when the, the on the day of the election or when the election is on the is about coming. And now look at what I've said. Look at what is happening. Look at what is happening. Look at what they are doing. They are trying to they are tra tackling each other's results. They are asking each other where the school they went to, the university they graduated from, and the kind of results they got and all of that. They don't need all of this. I wonder when this will end. What university the Shomole attend is not called for. It's not called for. Is it now that they should be asking each other all these questions about the school they graduated from? This is not the right time. When Obaseki was or came or contested for the first time as the governor of Edo State, all this question was not asked because then there have never there have not been any rifts between them. Then I'm very much sure that it's because of these rifts, the misunderstanding they are having with each other. Very much sure that because of this misunderstanding, this is why this issue of forged certificates is coming out. All these certificate case are mere distraction. A mere distraction to the election. The election is on the way. The election will take place by September. All these are all distraction. They are not called for. I think they should just let go of all these questions and certificate issue and contest. Then whosoever God wants him or whosoever God wants um, him to win this election or to become the governor of Edo State, then may God's will and wish be done. I thank God that Obaseki is confused is confused about the certificate case what is really the bone of contention what is really the bone of contention between Oshomole and Obaseki is it that is it lack of being lawyer by making returns one should put another person to light one 
should put on say what is exactly the bone of contention between these two people because any state that involves continually in this kind of practice cannot see the development needed in the face of a uh, uh, collect and share uh, uh, syndromes they should try and settle all of this because they don't need all this they don't need it this is just been ch- they're just being childish and that is it so viewers what would you have to say concerning this childish behavior among Oshomole and Obasiki? If you have any comments, please don't hesitate to drop your comment below the comment box. Click on the subscribe button as well as the bell button to receive updates whenever I publish new videos. And don't forget, share and like this news as well. Thank you.